Well, the Rainbow Warrior Volleyball team made its fourth consecutive NCAA title game appearance today. KITV4 Sports Director Brian Ojima is in Fairfax, Virginia with complete coverage of today's national championship game. Good evening, everyone. I'm Brian Ojima. It's the national championship game we were all waiting for. Number one, UCLA versus number two, Hawaii. Now, the Rainbow Warriors were trying to win their third consecutive national championship. That hasn't been done in 40 years. In fact, the last team to do it was UCLA back in 1983. Let's get right to the action. Pick it up in the first set. Hawaii serving in the far court. Check out Cole Hoagland sticking out his paw and getting the block. The Bows take a 9-6 lead. But UCLA answers back on the very next play. Merrick McHenry down the middle gets the kill. UCLA wins the first set, 28-26. In the second set, Jakob Tella makes UH history. This service ace coming up right here lands in the stands. Tella becomes the school's all-time leader in service aces. Congrats to him. Now later in the second set, UH leading 32-31. Check out Demetrius Muklius. His smash goes off the block and out of bounds. Hawaii wins the second set 33-31. But the Bruins come back to win the third set. Then in the fourth set, on match point, UH trailing 24-21. The Bows trying to stay alive, but UCLA's Ethan Champlin closes out the match. They review it, and the point was good. The Bruins defeat the Rainbow Warriors in four sets to win the national championship. Here's head coach Charlie Wade after the match. Yeah, congrats to UCLA. Um, thought they played uh, very well, obviously. Um, thought their serve receive was exceptional, and uh, the matchup in the middle, uh, we had a really didn't have much of an answer for it. Well, I won't be 100% satisfied, but I think for as a team, what we accomplished over the years just goes beyond sports. The brotherhood that we that we have built over the years, the culture of brotherhood and excellence, that's something you can never take away from what we have done, and that's more important than the results that we achieved. I'm proud of myself, and I'm proud for, for my teammates and coaches. You know, that's that, that was my mindset before uh, I entered this game. Uh, I didn't know the result. We might win, we might lose. But all I knew is that if I give 100%, I'll just be proud of myself. I'll have no regrets. And that's what we did. Unfortunately, we didn't get the result we wanted. So it's not the way Jakob Tella and Demetrius Muklius wanted to end their illustrious careers at UH, but those two will certainly go down as two of the best to ever play for the program. Now, the 29 wins for the Rainbow Warriors are the most ever in a single season at Hawaii. That'll wrap up our coverage of the NCAA tournament here in Fairfax, Virginia. I'm Brian Ojima. We'll send it back to the studio.